What's up guys? We just wrapped up a day at the shop and now we're here at the Blue Star Arts Complex at Brick where our beloved Kenny is spinning some tunes as well as a great vintage streetwear events going on. So we're gonna go over there, catch some fits, see what everyone's wearing. Uh, it's gonna be a great video, so stick around. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all that noise, but we'll catch you inside. I can't. Sound production. All right, bro, All right. so we fuck with the fit. All right, appreciate it. Can you it. break it down? Tell us about the shirt. All right, we just got a 90s Selena bootleg right here. Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, it's got the sleeve hit and then the back hit as well. Wow. It's not single stitch, it's double stitch. Looked like it was made in a grandma's backyard, but yeah. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's what we got going on. Sometimes those graphics are better that, than the yeah, OGs. Yeah, for real. That is Dude. what's better than the OGs, honestly. Shit that was made in somebody's backyard, bro. Dude, Hell sold yeah, at man. the flea market and shit, bro. Dude, you got a little bit of the new mixed with the old. It yeah. all looks so great. Yeah. Honestly. Are those Carhartts as well? Yeah. Damn. Double, they're double knees. The double knee Carhartts with the Selena. With the Travis. Bro. Dope. You're doing it. I like mix. And, I like hype. I've liked hype since I was like younger. Yeah. And then it just got to vintage and shit. So like, it's really a mix. Like, and you could mix them up new with the old shit. Absolutely, dude. Like, I how's, fuck with it. How's the event been for you so far? It's been pretty good, bro. It's been chill. Uh, everybody said they're making some money. So I mean, as long as everybody's making some bread, breaking bread, that, that's the that's the main point it. of all of this, bro. That's Absolutely. what we're trying to bring together the community shit. Dude, it's a beautiful venue too. Like, no, yeah, that brick is badass. always super fun. And it's it's not too cold in there, but it ain't too hot. So dude, hey, it stays hey, out of the sun and shit. Better to be cold than hot right now, dude. Mm -hmm, bro, and, for sure. And thank this you for hot. thank you for getting Kenny up on the, the bro, spinning, bro. I told you also we had to, bro. Yeah. Kenny had to come out here because I heard him at the vaulty like I think the past three times I was there. Yeah. And I was like, bro, we for sure gotta get Kenny out here, bro. So I'll thank you, bro. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah, bro. Of course. Right. And thank you so much for the aside, bro. Yeah, Appreciate bro, you. Of course. Uh what's your IG? Uh Dirty South Grills. Mm -hmm. And then if y'all wanna come check us out, it's uh we're trying to do this every month, every month or two. Hell yeah. If you want, no stress or pressure whatsoever. Well, so we saw your outfit. We thought you looked super cool. Can you tell us about it? Um, so I actually wore this to match with my friend Dan. Um, she was selling clothes inside with me, and she said I'm wearing blue and green. So I looked for blue and green, and uh, I found this shirt. She said she had florals, and then. This was like the only pants I thought I would like look badass with it. So awesome. Yeah, I just really wanted to match her. Yeah. And wear black, blue, and green. Dude, that accessorizing with the bracelet mm -hmm. too, with the little flowers on it, super super yeah. cute. Yeah. This is from San Antonio. I think it was made here as well. Um, at the Market Square downtown. Awesome. Supporting local as well. Yeah. That's super I, I cool. Love it, yeah. Is there like an era or a time piece that you kind of like synonymize this with, or is this just um, something that you thought it's like? I want to match with my friend. This is the colors that I'm picking because I think this is a very groovy outfit to me. Oh, I think it's you. so that's, so cool. That's what I get. I like what inspires me so a lot. It's a lot of color, okay. um, like juxtaposition. So like strange colors that don't look like they would go together. But when people wear them, like orange and purple, complementary colors. Yeah. And that's really a color blocking, like patchwork a lot as well. Absolutely. That really inspires me. And that's like from the '60s mod. Era. Yeah, and for sure. The '70s, like you're saying, groovy. Yeah. It's so cool, and then the eyeshadow to match with it as well. It's just like everything looks so good together. Oh, so. I appreciate yeah, that. And what's your name? I'm Kubo. Nice to meet you, Kubo. Do you have an Instagram that you want to? K-U.B-0, Kubo, catch me. Hell yeah. And thank you so much for your time, Thanks, Kubo. Thanks, Carla. Appreciate you. Peace. We love your outfit. We're just wondering if you can tell us about it. Okay, so this is thrifted. I don't remember where I found it, but... It's just really cute. I'm really into like the hibiscus, a uh, very summer tropical vibe. That's really what I go for all the time. Um, boots, AliExpress, not thrifting. Sorry. Dang. <laughs> Sixty dollars. It took a month to ship, so I'll send you the link if you want it. <laughs> They're super cool. Yeah, thank you. And then I just bought this right now from Apartment One Four Four. Super cute. I'm really into butterflies. And yeah, the seven 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 seventeen is my lucky number. So this is the necklace that I always wear. Um, and yeah, I feel like that's really it. <laughs> Is there anything that inspired your outfit today? Um, honestly, no. I just kind of put on whatever I feel like wearing, whatever's the vibe, and then just roll with it. All right, and so. then last question. Okay. Is there a fashion trend that you really like right now or you really dislike right now? 
Um, I don't know about dislike. What I really like right now are like the mini skirts and baby tees. That's okay. like super fun right now for summer. So I would say that's my fave. I don't know about dislike, but for sure fave. No worries awesome. at all. Yeah. And if you want to let the people know where to find you and everything like that. Um, you can follow my Instagram. My personal is at lovelyisdanny. And then my shop is at shoplovelyisdanny. So yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Thank cool. You so Thank much. you so much. Thank you guys. Yeah, so can you tell us about your fit? What's up, what's up? So I'm Alex with Violets of Thrift. So this is my this is my grill I have right now, honestly. It's the Darth Maul uh, AOP front and back. Wow. Uh, yeah, so this is me on that that old Lee tag. And I've been looking for this tee for a minute, but every time I see it's an XL. So I finally got a large, which you know doesn't fit too too baggy, you know, fits nice. It fits perfect. And we got the I think these are some some old Dickies. Dude. Yeah, but the fade on the on the bottom is crazy because when you when you fold them, it has they're like a different color on the inside. Yeah, nice. dude, the yeah. cuff adds a different layer. Yeah, a little to cream, it. a little cream yeah, feel. Dude. Dope, yeah, dude. Yeah, dope. Yeah. And what do you got on your feet today? Uh, these are some some Jordans and Nikes. It's kind of dirty right now. Hey, you but, gotta wear your shoes though. Right. I was at an event at Rumble last week, so they're all dusty. Yeah, that Absolutely. happens there a lot. Yeah, <laughs> right. Oh, yeah, um, yeah. what kind of hat do you have on? Uh, this is a Nike. So this is like a. I honestly don't even know what to call it. So it's a Nike. Like a brimless. Yeah, it's gonna be a white tag. Wow. Nineties. Yeah. That's so cool, especially yeah. with the tag on the inside. Yeah, too. right with the white tag. Insane, bro. I just like found it when I first started thrifting a long time ago. Yeah, yeah super cool. And yeah. so tell us a little bit about the event today. Yeah, so the event we're having right now is called Saturdays at Brick. So it's gonna be like vintage art, CBD, all of the great vendors. You know, we got some baked goods in there too. So nice. it's definitely a nice vibe. You know, indoors, so it's not too hot because lately it's been. Dude ridiculously hot, yeah. so. <laughs> we know that too well. Yeah, dude. I know, yeah. We, I've, done, I've done y'all events, you know, past couple Saturdays, and it's been super hot, but, you know, good turnout still. Dude, so. absolutely, and this turnout was amazing as well, so. Yeah, I figure, like, cool. I figure right after y'all's ended, you know, people can head over here, Perfect. so it's like a, you know, nice little combo. Exactly you know right. Good way to end the so. night indoors. You know, like that, exactly so. right, and so I got two questions for you. Yeah, One, cool. is there a fashion trend that you don't like right now, or that kind of, like bugs you or two is there a special like meaning to this output or the tea or anything like that okay and you can answer one or both of them if you yeah, like definitely uh for the tea i would say yeah because star wars is like my favorite i grew up watching that you know with my dad like all the the movies so mm -hmm. i have a little collection i think i have like five of the liquid blues Dude. right now a couple of tie-dye ones you know mm -hmm. jar jar binks one of them so I've been hoarding all my Star Wars lately, so. Would you say Darth Maul is one of your favorite characters? I would say Darth Maul is my favorite character, honestly. I actually found a, his saber like at the no at way. the thrifts. You know, has a, the double the sword, double sided. Yeah, so. That's so sick. And dude. it was dated 2001, like Hasbro on it. So. Wow, dude, yeah, actually so like on actual, it too. Yeah, yeah. Dude, that's so sick, dude. Yeah, so definitely, he's definitely my favorite favorite dude, uh, character for that. That's so franchise. sick, man. And nope. do you want to shout out your Instagram real quick? Yeah, definitely. It's a uh, Viosa Thrift, so V I O S A. Uh, yeah, yeah cool. for sure. appreciate Thank you, man. So much, hey, man. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate you, Have bro. a good one. Yep. So it's been so far. Some people got some good outfits today. I can't. I can't even knock them. We got the Darth Maul all over print. We got the '70s, '60s inspired. We got a little bit of everything today. So we're gonna keep going and see if we can find any other cool outfits. But let's go. Hey, I'm Noah. Um, I guess we'll start with the fee. These are the Nike CS Tennis Classic. I really fuck with these shoes. I have a lot of versions and colorways of this shoe because it's a really clean white sneaker that's not just an Air Force One. Absolutely. Everyone has Air Force One, so I like that and I pair that with a lot of fits. Um, the Dickies, Dickies overalls. One strap them, you know. I fuck yeah. with the logo as well. That logo I have a couple is different so pairs of these. Um, under that, I got a wolf tee. I got, I think, in Austin at an Adventure's place. Me and my girl got matching wolf tees. Don't judge me, you know what I mean? That's super but, sick. Um, the necklace, I got a Chanel pearl. Wow. I got this at an antique store a couple years ago. That's um, beautiful. I got a lot of rings and accessories I picked up at a lot of different spots. Uh, you have vintage a spots. One? I like this combination, probably these two. Uh, just because uh, when I saw it, I just really fucked with it. Or, I love the way that you accessorize them. Much appreciated. Yeah. Absolutely, dude. Um, what else I got? Oh, Glasses, they're Prada. They're hey. from the early 2000s. I copped them online. Beautiful. Um, I got this funky chunk. That's a <laughs> side cool bag. Ass brand. Um, I got it in Austin, but then also I paired 
uh, a the Louis Vuitton lock? lock. Yeah, I had a, a Louis Vuitton lock for a while, and then I just put it on here. That's so Sick. cool, dude. So, yeah, I mean, besides that, little bracelets, this, that, and the other, but... That's it's super tight, dude. Too. Is there anything that inspired this outfit today? Um... This market okay. gotta be fitted up, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, a hundred percent. And oh, is there yeah. like a fashion trend that you really don't like or you really do like right now? Um, don't like just a lot of the hats. There's gotta be originality. Yeah, no, that I fuck with. <laughs> okay, yeah, okay, yeah, okay, for sure. But like the just the regular fitted, and then they they sewed one thing on the side. I think we're done with that for now. Okay. Is there put it away. Put it away. <laughs> is there a trend that you do like? Um. No, I'm gonna keep it. I like everything right now how it's going, but no certain trends I'm fucking with. I feel that, dude. To be honest. And then let the people know your name and your ID. Uh, I'm Noah. I actually have a CBD shop in the area. So Remedy CBD One, check me out. Super um, cool, for sure. Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time, Noah. Appreciate you. Thank you. Awesome. Oh, now it's like, oh, can I take it nice. out? So, it's like so first the off the back challenge, like yeah. yeah. and then the Rolling Stones. I'm on fire, bro. I don't know what to tell you. Bro, so we fuck with the fit. Yes, sir. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Yes, sir. Fit right now, you know, some casual came to came to the brig, popped up here. Uh, nice little bulls wrap tee. Personally picked this myself. Found it in the field. Wow. Um, yeah, was able to keep it. So me and my business partner, G's, you know, we had to talk about it. Yo, I need nice. this. Mm -hmm. uh, paid a dollar for it, so damn come up on nice. Time. Dude, Can we check the back out? Crazy back kid, of course. Wow. That's Pippin. I think Rodman, uh, Jordan. Uh, but my favorite thing about it is just because it focuses on Jordan more in the front. Uh, really nobody else. Of course, him. You know, one of the ghosts. So yeah, yeah. it's low key uh, like a Jordan rap. Yeah, instead low of like key. A Bulls rap. And then you go to the back, so you see all of them. So I think it's crazy. That's uh, definitely Bay it. Bay Club, so OG one. Um, oh, yeah. Pants, one of my favorite pants. Personally, picked these up as well uh, at the rags as well. Some Levi's, I think 501s. Nice little character paint. Um, nice little cream color too, so you can never go wrong. Yeah, yeah. yeah. dressing in color is crazy. Yeah, I did some of it myself, but by wearing them, so I think that's pretty dope. Yeah, that counts. That yeah, counts. Yeah. <laughs> and then of course at the feet. What you got on the feet? Uh, breads, you know, bread ones. Uh, I've had them since they came out. Uh, put all the wear in them. I know people have been uh, yeah. yellowing their yeah. souls, but yeah. not me. Definitely just decided to wear them as much as I could. So yeah. Don't yeah, think yeah, just dude. character to it. That's but super yeah. sick. Is, yeah. is there anything that inspired this outfit today? Or is uh, there any reason why you picked this out today? Honestly, because we were going to be active heavy. We went picking in the morning, okay. then opened the shop, and then coming over here. So it's like, literally, we were going to be active 18 hours. I had to wear something nice. So. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. it's Friday or Saturday. So yeah. Dude, we, had, we made the same mistake earlier. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> and then one other question. Yeah, man. Is there a fashion trend that you really don't like or a fashion trend that you really do like? One or the other, or both. I think everything's just kind of dope. In my in my perspective, I feel like everyone's genre is different, and I just take everything in because I mean anybody could put you on on certain stuff. Like I've been put on, you know, I, maybe I put on somebody on something I've worn. You so I think have. everything is dope to me. Like no matter what it is, it just depends. I think it's just confidence. So that's my my perspective on it. So whatever you wear is dope. So Absolutely. just you know, drip it out as much as you can. Hell yeah, that's dude! The way I see it. And let the people know where to find you, where to shop with you, everything. Yes, sir. Shout out the Balti Boys first of all. Shout out James. Shout out Carlos. Thank uh, you. Been my dogs for a minute. If y'all don't know, y'all must know. Uh, but follow us, Rio Five, the gallery. We have a store also, a little brick and mortar, uh, vintage streetwear and all. But make sure to follow the Balti. You know where to find them. Of and make sure to follow Rio Five. Follow us. You know the vibes. Hell yeah. Dope. Thank you, Ezra. Yes, sir. Appreciate All right, bro. So we fuck with the fit. We're just wondering if you could break it down for us and tell us a little bit about it. Of course, bro. I have the Selena shirt on. This is going to be like a motion picture shirt, radio hit on the back. Dang. Little J Lo on the front. Um, Fear God Essential shorts. You know what I'm saying? Some slight, and then of course the the cement floor, the classic. You can mix a little bit of the old with the new. Yes, sir. Everything yes, sir. super fly. Thank you, bro. Coordinated together. Try to keep it simple. Some slight. No, absolutely, dude. But is there anything that inspired this outfit today? I uh, must ask. Nah, just just neutral colors. Just keeping it nice and you know nice and easy for the heat. You know, yeah. saying <laughs> something that's you know saying gonna be nice and relaxed. Yeah, dude. This Texas heat, no fucking joke, bro. Oh my god, bro. I know what the Lord's cooking up there, but <laughs> it's done. Yeah, exactly <laughs> right. And then I got one more question yeah. for you. Is there a fashion trend right now that you really like or you really dislike? Mm, 
I can't really say that I dislike or like anything right now. I think right now is like just like a crazy time for fashion in general. Okay. I just think right now is like a time where people are just experimenting with a lot of different things. Good so point. I think it's cool, bro. Um, definitely no hate. It's all love on this side, bro. So I mean, it's just respect all the way around. That's the way to do it, man. Yeah. But let the people know where to find you, where to shop with you. Real Five. Uh, we're located at two three two two Blanco Road. Come shop with us. We're open Monday through Saturday, one to six. Uh, yeah. yeah. Thank you so much, dude. Thanks, brother. Appreciate, Appreciate you. Appreciate y'all. Dang. Oh, God. Dude, I love it. Dude, we just got the, the vintage graphic, Good Girls Go to Heaven and Bad Girls Go to Cancun, uh, with the Powerpuff Girls on it. And it's so cool that we just get to see that. But So, we fuck with the fit. We see the Tupac rat tee. Yes, sir. Tell Tupac. us about it. Um, bought this like two years ago for like a hundred bucks. Some girl just wanted to like throw it out there, so I was like, oh yeah. Wow, little front nice. hit, back hit. I, I bought, I brought an extra shirt just in case for the fit. But wow. Green Day. You came too. Little back ready. hit, just in case. You know, it, Texas heat, like you were saying. Yeah. Hot as shit. Absolutely. Um, but I, I had to stunt to the pants, so a girl hit me up on Depop, and she was like, hey, like. Shout me out for the pants, and she made them for me, 40 bucks. Wow. They're actually girls' jeans, but they're fire. She custom made them. So, and then the little CG. Dude, the distressing on the back. Yes, sir, the back. Dude. Dude. Yes, sir. Can't go wrong with it. Love the color green. It's kind of growing on me with the bandana, so. Absolutely, dude. Can't go wrong with it, man. I'll ask you the yes, same sir. question. I'm so, ready. is there anything that inspired this fit today? Just the color green, man, okay. honestly. I wanted to stunt. I haven't done, like, a pop-up in, like, Two three years, so I was like, "Fuck it, you know." Well, welcome back, hey, sir. Hell yeah, yeah, dude. Yeah. Oh, and go. then also, is there a fashion trend that you really like or you really dislike right Honestly, now? Honestly, all the old like true vintage, like the varsity jackets and all uh, that, like, dude, it's growing on me. Like, I can't wear it because it's Texas, you know. Fair it's enough. Hot as shit, but it's growing on me, man. The true dude, vintage, like for the varsity sure. patches, yes, like sir, everything yes, sir, like that. All like the seventies, eighties for sure. Perfect, yeah. dude. And let the people know where to find you uh, and everything like that. Damn, that's rare. I found some rare shit, so hit me up. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah. Appreciate well, you so much, bro. Yes, sir. Appreciate, Appreciate you. you. Well, so we love your outfit. Thank you. Can you tell us a little bit about it and what it ins what inspired you sure. to put this on today? Honestly, I feel like I don't usually wear this, but I do wear these Converse all the time. They're just easy. They're platforms. I'm really short, so I like to wear platforms. And then I found these pants, which is rare that pants fit me like. I don't know, the like nice this. I do have them a little dirty, I'm so sorry. And then I like them because I can put my keys on there. And then I have this my sorry, it's like vintage. Well, it's not vintage, I got it at the concert, but <laughs> 2014. Everybody always compliments me on this shirt because Smiley is cute. And yeah. It's a crazy oh, shirt. And then this tote bag, Denim Cowboy. He does a lot of denim work, San Antonio like local, and he's really good. He always has like pins and stuff, back pockets, like he goes crazy. So. Yes. Awesome, cool. And Thank is there you. any fashion trend that you do like or you don't like right now? Huh, what is, I don't even know what's like going on right now. Because I honestly just work with what I have and I okay. thrift and I just like find random stuff. Like I bought like this bag today. Come on. Ooh. Like this is like when I'm going out, like day. Oh, and What's I bought a matching it? skirt. It's in here. Dang. I just bought it today inside because these people, like they know what they're doing, I'm telling you. But yeah. Dang. Yes. The rivets on that bag. Yeah, so and I have cute. like a black version kind of, so okay. I was like, come on, I have to. I Perfect. Have to do it. Awesome. So, yeah. And can you tell us about your accessories? Oh, they're all <laughs> mine. I'm like, oh, the accessories. So I sell jewelry, so like I pierce as well. So everything I'm wearing is literally mine. Every like jewelry item. I don't have my rings on because I was piercing earlier today, but um, this is like my new collection, and then everything else is just stuff I've built up to. Awesome. Yes. And, and I also bracelets. do like. Yeah, I do forever jewelry, so I weld. So I have like gold and silver. I have solid gold, so that's like lifetime worth of permanent jewelry. So wow, yes. I do a lot. So much for your time. Do you yes. want to let people know where they can shop with you? Um, sure. So my jewelry brand is called Apartment One Forty Four. If you look it up on Instagram, it's just at apt dot one forty four. I've had it for four years. It's been awesome. a journey. <laughs> thank you. Uh, yeah, thank you so much, Paulina. <laughs> for sure, thank Appreciate you. Appreciate you. Sweet. Thank y'all for tuning in to this video. We just checked out some amazing outfits at Brick from Saturdays, this amazing pop-up event that they're gonna be doing every Saturday at Brick. But thank y'all so much for tuning in. 
get ready for the next video. We're gonna be doing this at a lot of different locations, but don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We're gonna be hitting y'all's feed with a lot of new videos. So if y'all wanna see that, y'all wanna see some behind the scenes of the Vaulty Boys, um, some random events that we go to, anything like that, leave us a like, leave us a comment. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see y'all next time. Peace.